Hey, Harper. Hi, Isa. Did you see that cool lizard by the swings yesterday? Yeah. I wonder what kind of lizard it was. I'm not sure. Do you know much about reptiles? Not really. I know lizards are reptiles, but that's about it. Me too. Maybe we should ask someone who knows more. How about Miss Bella? She knows a lot about animals. Yeah, that's a good idea. Come on, let's go. Hi, Miss Bella. Do you have a minute? Of course, Isa. Hi, Harper. What's up? We were talking about reptiles and realized we don't know much about them. Miss Bella? What do you really mean by reptiles? Reptiles are cold-blooded animals, which means they need to warm up in the sun because they can't generate their own body heat. Could you tell us more? They have scales and breathe air through lungs. Can you tell me some examples of reptiles? Sure, here we go. Turtles and tortoises. Turtles live in or near water and have protective shells. Lizards. Lizards have long bodies and tails. Some can change colors, like the chameleon. Snakes. Snakes have long, slender bodies and no legs. They move by slithering. Crocodiles and alligators. Crocodiles and alligators are large reptiles with powerful jaws. Crocodiles have V-shaped snouts, while alligators have U-shaped snouts. Wow, I didn't know there were so many different kinds of reptiles. Thank you, Miss Bella. Now we know so much more about reptiles. Anytime, kids. Always happy to help you learn something new. I'm so glad we talked to Miss Bella. Now we know so much more about reptiles. Oh, looks like it's time to head back to class. Yeah. Bye, Harper. See you later, Isa.